Hello and welcome. This is Raheem Zulfikar Ali from Excel Basement Private Limited. In this video tutorial, we will learn that how to calculate time uh, between two dates in form of uh, different intervals like uh, number of days, number of months and number of years. So let's get started. I have uh, imported a data set from my one of uh, Excel workbook uh, and let me show you. So the table name is dates and uh, there are two columns start date and end date so let's get started how we can calculate uh, the time difference uh, of various intervals by using DAX so I will click on this small icon uh, that is the data tab and uh, this gives me a new window uh, where I can see the, my data and uh, on the table tools tab I will click on new column because I will insert a new column to calculate a time difference so I will click on new column and in next few seconds a new column will insert it. Okay, so let's get start. Uh, the first we will give the name of uh, this column. So that will be number of days and after that equals to space and we will use the DAX which is called dated if and this dated if also uh, the function syntax says that uh, returns the number of units a unit is specified in interval and that will be calculated between the input two dates okay so the interval uh, is not limited to calculate the number of days or months it it can also calculate the number of quarters minutes seconds as well so let's get start uh, dated if bracket open so the first function argument is date one which it will be always the starting date so the table name is uh, dates and the column is a start date and in the day two in the day two we will uh, put the end dates so again that table name is dates and uh, column name is end date and now we need to put the interval that uh, which kind of time difference we want to calculate from data def uh, either we want number of days to calculate between two days or hours or month or week or year right so let's first uh, see how we calculate the number of days between two dates so i will just press the round bracket to close this uh, dax and i will press the enter key so now within few seconds you can see here on the screen a new column which is the calculated column in which we have uh, put uh, one DAX which is called dated F right and it shows number of days right all right so let's insert another column so I will again click on new column and this time we will uh, calculate the time as an interval of number of months so first we will give a nice name number of months equals to space dated if so the first column will be of start date then end dates and we want number of months so we will put month in the interval and then round bracket so we will get number of months between the two dates right so you can see that uh, because I have put five different kind of dates of uh, different years and months so you can see and analyze accordingly right now next is for years so again we will click on new column First, let's give a name to this column number of years and again we will apply dated if so in date one we will put dates start date and then end dates and then we want interval of year right okay so in next few seconds you will have this calculated column and now you can see that uh, the number of years so I hope you like this video and you have learned one more new DAX which is dated if to calculate the time difference from between the two dates, right? Thank you.